You ever actually thought about making a Roblox game, but thought, man, I ain't got the skills for it? Well, now you might actually be able to do it. Before we get into the video, only a small percent is subscribed. If you really like this video, hit the subscribe button. It really means a lot. So the RTC tweeted out, Roblox has officially put an AI that allows everyone to easily script. It's called generative AI, and it can code using an artificial intelligence, helping break barriers, meaning you don't have to have the skills like before, you know, to make games in Roblox. Now there's some help. Today, Roblox provides creators with a platform that enables end-to-end -end tools, services, blah, blah, blah. As we all know, generative AI learns the underlying patterns and structures of data and generates new content, such as images, audio, code, text, 3D models, other forms of media. For example, some creators know how to code, but may have limited experience creating high-fidelity 3D models. Others may be more experienced with model design, but less experienced with code. In both cases, we see a future in which a beginner, such as myself, for example, I'm a terrible artist, the guy writing this article, can get a running head start as they look to bring their imagination to life and Roblox experience. So I don't know a lot about this kind of stuff myself. I mean, 3D modeling and all that. As far as like end users that didn't have any experience doing this stuff before, will now be able to utilize this generative AI and actually in the tools that Roblox is providing to get more people to make games on there, which could be a bad thing, but it could be a good thing. You know what I mean? The bad thing, meaning that there's going to be a lot of kids trying to do this now. There's going to be a lot of crappy games. I mean, let's be realistic. But on the other hand, it'll help create actually make really cool games in Roblox. Typically what they mean by this is a creator could design a car through a simple statement such as a red two-seater convertible sports car with a front-wheel drive and the code in the background will generate off of that statement. But anyways, just thought this is interesting. I'll put the link to this uh, blog in the, in the description below. But yeah, check this out. And that's all I want to talk about. If you like my stuff, hit subscribe, hit that bell notification. We'll talk to you later.